I was born in Storm, Victoria, 30th of March 1932. I was really a keen cyclist from the age of 14 and won many races in, the, in, in and around Storm. My best achievement in my belief was that I, I was able to win the Storm 50 mile road race from a field of 140 riders. I left school age of 15, but I should have kept on from school, and I did go back to school for another three years. I joined the ESNA bank at Stall. Eventually, I was transferred to Caston, where I met Noel. My dad was pretty unimpressed with you um, as a banker. He didn't like bankers. Then I told him that you were a bike rider, and suddenly you were fine. And then we got married in the same church that my mum and dad were married in. Um, your daddy was born on the 21st December 1960. We were transferred to Foster in, in South Gippsland and made many, many good friends. I was able to fulfil a dream of mine and that was to be able to fly an aeroplane. An achievement that uh, I'm really proud of and because I never ever got lost. <laughs> Your mummy and your daddy got married in 1990 and uh, we welcomed our first grandchild, which was you, Amy, on the 28th of November 1991. Emily, you came along on the 29th of June 1994. We were really enjoying our life then with you and mummy and daddy. Unfortunately, there was a car accident and all of you were in the car accident. Uh, you were all slightly injured but your daddy died in the car crash. And then something else happened which was just as bad. Uh, your great pa died about six weeks after daddy died. And I remember you running through great nana's house looking for great pa when you came up and you said he's not in his chair. He's not in the bedroom. He must be dead. Now, it was during this time that poor Grandpa started to have trouble with his memory. In 1999, our doctor said that Grandpa should see a specialist, but it just got worse. This must have been difficult for you and Emily because you didn't understand what was happening to Grandpa. The diagnosis was Alzheimer's. I see myself as losing Max. Max is still here, but I feel that I'm losing the person that Max was once. The reason for creating this brief snapshot of my life is I am very proud of your achievement individually and I hope your future will be bright. I would like to think that there will still be more of those happy times to come.